Good morning, Stitchy friends. Welcome to my second half of March. I'm just sitting here doing my diamond painting and I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you that. I hope that you guys have had a fabulous March so far. And uh, yeah, the rest of the month will bring in spring. So this is where I'm at so far in my diamond painting. I usually do a page a month and so this is where I'm at for March. I still have all of this to do for the month. Um, so I'll get it done eventually. And I finally got my containers. So these are the containers that I ordered from AliExpress. It can hold about two or three bags in one of these containers. And then I have all the rest of my beads just right here. This is where I had my those ones that I was using. And uh, so now that I don't need all of that room anymore, I can just put the leftover beads in, in there. So that's that. And um, yeah. Uh, I'm liking how it's turning so far. Let's see how it is with the lights out. There you go. Look at that tree, hey? Huh. So cool. And for those of you who are new or maybe have forgotten, uh, I am stitching this piece. It is not a heaven and earth. It is a pain-free crafts. It is a retired chart. And... Uh, that's what it will look like when finished. Good evening, guys. I have a page finish. I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you. I'm talking quietly because Allison is sleeping in the living room because she has a cold, so she likes to sleep uh, sort of sitting up when she has a cold. So I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you. Yeah. So there's my page finish and what I do when I finish a page is I mark the date on it. So for this one I finished this on March the 12th and then I finished this today's March 14th. So it only took me three days to do this page which is surprising because I didn't realize that, that that's, it was just that short. So now I think I'm going to I'm going to move this up so that it's not so close to the edge of the snap. Uh, cuz I have a bit of fabric that I'll see, show you. I have a bit of fabric that I can work with and move it up. So I think that's what I'm going to do. And I think I'm going to I'm just going to start on this page right here tomorrow. So, I thought that I would show you guys it in its completeness so far before I put it in its snaps. So there you have it. It's looking pretty cool. I wonder if I brought it closer if you could see the sparkle. Yeah, you can see the sparkle. You see all that sparkle? All that crack? Oh yeah, yeah, and the snow is sparkling. It really does sparkle. Snow really does sparkle. Uh, so I'm going to put it in its snaps now. Good afternoon, Stitchy friends. Yeah, I got sick. So you're going to have to excuse me in a couple of clips here while you listen to my voice. Uh, I didn't do any stitching yesterday. I wasn't able to. I've done very little stitching today. And I'll just turn you guys around and show you what little I've gotten done since I've last spoken to you. So I did this the day that I got sick. I got sick later in the afternoon. I don't know if it was Saturday or Sunday. I don't remember. My days are all foggy. It's now Tuesday, by the way. So I did this the day that I got sick, but in the morning, because then in the afternoon, that's when it hit me and I was down. I did this. I did just this today. Um, but to let you know that this is the the edge of the page line. So I'm just, this is just one page right here. 
<clears throat> majority of it, majority of it, I would say a good maybe 45% of it is black. So, as you can see, that A is black. So, <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so I have a paper due on Thursday. It's half done. And so I will get that done and I will stitch a little bit on this um, up until I get that done. Just a little bit and then once it's done then I will have my exam to study for which is on Wednesday. So it's in a, my exam's in a, in a week and a day. So um, I think I'm going to just work on this until Friday or Saturday and then I will put it away and uh, bring out my dragonfly. But I'll show you guys in a couple of days here um, how far I actually get. This is all just basically bonus, bonus stitching uh, as I like to call it because my goal was to actually finish this page and to finish this partial page here which I, I completed. Uh, so I'm just doing bonus stitching for all I'm concerned. Um, but getting however much I can get done is awesome. Like, I want to finish this as soon as possible. So in light of that being said, um, this being my major, my major project here right now to, to get it finished, I'm not sure you're going to see much stitching like it's going to be just this and it's going to be my chatelaine and it's going to be well the, I don't I don't really count my temperature garden because I'm stitching on that every every five or six days and so and it's just a flower so that takes like takes like 15 or 20 minutes to do a flower and then the grass and the stem and all that it takes about 20 minutes so that really takes no time at all, and I'm going to be doing that throughout the entire year. So that's not really a big project that takes a whole lot of time. Um, so for this portion of the vlog, you're just going to be seeing this and then my dragonfly. And then, of course, my temperature garden. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so it might be boring. <laughs> it might be a boring vlog. We'll see what happens. It's still only the, it, what is it? It's the 17th today. So still lots of time in eight March yet. But the sun is shining, the snow is melting, and uh, maybe we'll see some brown mud today, this month. <laughs> Never know. I am gonna say one thing that I really appreciate. Uh, Ingeborg and Mika's videos on their Netherlands retreat. I really enjoyed watching it and uh, I'm so glad that you guys had such an awesome and successful retreat. It was such a treat for us to be able to watch it through your eyes as two people who have not been to a big retreat and Ingeborg uh, planning that. That's awesome. You did a wonderful job. I wasn't there but from the videos it looked awesome. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go one year. I am. I love the Netherlands. If I was to go again, it would be my third time being back there, and I would be going to a whole whole new area to where your stitching the stitching store is. Um, so, and the awesome thing is that I always I'd love the Netherlands, but it's such an easy and I say easy. It's an eight hour flight. But it's a direct flight from Edmonton, which is the airport that I would be flying out of. If I wanted to travel anywhere in Europe, if I wanted to travel anywhere in the UK, it would all have to go through Amsterdam. So I would have to fly to Amsterdam, and then from Amsterdam I would have to catch connecting flights. But if I was going, if my destination was just Amsterdam, and then I was taking a train to where, wherever this village or town is, then that would be awesome. So hopefully next time you guys have a retreat planned for next year, I'll be in a better situation. Because <laughs> uh, not such a good situation right now, 
but um, I'm not going to get into that in my floss tube video, but um, yeah, there's always hope for the future. So thank you guys for sharing that and awesome, awesome job. Good morning, Stitchy friends. It is March the 21st and it is snowing again. Very pretty, but I don't want to see snow. I want it to go away, but that's spring for you. There's my big winter puppy. Having a, having a morning nap. Ah, look friends, it's second winter. Yeah, that means spring is gonna arrive soon. As soon as we get through this, that is. Woo! Good morning, guys. Happy Saturday. I am just gonna show you my flower here and where I'm gonna be leaving it off for the month. And then I will show you that guy, which is my temperature garden. So I'm just going to turn you guys around and see. I haven't been stitching much the past couple days, but uh, it is what it is. And uh, that's it. I'll show you what I, I do have, though. So this is where I got to on the bottom page here. Uh, I think I'm going to leave it here now for the month. It is Saturday. But I have an exam on Wednesday. And so... I have to study um, and uh, so I think I'm just gonna put this away and pull out my dragonfly for when I do stitch uh, yeah but considering that I got finished this page did all of this little page and then got this much started I'm pretty happy I'm happy with the with this month's progress as for this guy over here, let's see, it has been, it's cold right now, as I saw, you saw a couple of clips where it's been snowing, um, that was this day where it was snowing, because that's the zero to minus two mark, both of those, and so, yeah. It's been, it's been okay though, like it hasn't been like super warm, but warm enough that I'm not stitching that much blue anymore. Just, just every now and again I'm stitching a blue. But, um, yeah, I can't erase my, my, my snow hills because it keeps snowing. Maybe, maybe over here it'll stop, but I doubt it because I think it was snowing yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday that I showed you it was snowing. I'm getting all mixed up in my days. So that's it for now, guys. Good afternoon, guys. I hope you're all well. It's been a couple of days since I've vlogged. I'm terrible at vlogging this, this time around. Uh, just lots going on and just very busy, very stressful time. As you can see, I, I, I don't have the heart to take down Belle. She's hanging on the curtains there with uh, clips and magnets and I don't have the heart to put her in the drawer with all the other pieces that I finished. But, so that's the classy way I have her finished up there. But uh, I'm going to show you what I have on my dragonfly, which is <laughs> quite pathetic. There is nothing I would like to do more than just sit and stitch my heart away on my dragonfly, but it's not happening. It's not happening till this exam is done. I have an exam tomorrow. Uh, so I have to study because that's what you have to do. But I'm going to turn you around and show you um, where the page line started and then just what I've gotten done. So that is just what I have gotten done. 
I'm trying to fold this paper back so that you don't see it. So that's the, basically the page where the page started. So this is all that I've gotten done since I've had it out for, well, it's, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday and I, and I pulled it out on a Saturday. So this is all I've gotten done since Saturday. So I will, um, I will continue to stitch on it until the 31st. Um, uh, I will be doing very little stitching today and then very little stitching tomorrow for the exam. Um, but then I'll have the 29th, 30th, and 31st to um, to stitch on it. Because after my exam, then I'm on spring break, so I won't have any classes till um, the 9th. The 9th. So I'll have like a whole week. Almost, almost two weeks off all a week I don't know figure it out yourself I don't know my brain is squished so um yeah I've got a sneak peek of what's coming up my one year anniversary of um going to Italy good afternoon friends it's been a couple days since I've vlogged uh, I have not been keeping up on it. There have been things going on, and uh, I just haven't been stitching or diamond painting. Um, last night I finally sat down and I did a bit of stitching. I'll show you that in just a sec. I'm just sitting here now. It's um, Saturday. It's the day after Good Friday, so we're in between Good Friday and Easter. Um, we're about to go to my nieces for Easter. And I'm just sitting here doing some diamond painting. So I thought that I would show you what I've gotten done. I'm still working on it a little bit until we go. And I might work on it a bit tonight. We'll see how I feel. But I think today is the last day of March. But I'm not really sure. If not, it's tomorrow. So I'm not going to complete my page on my diamond painting. And I'm not going to complete my page on my dragonfly. But hey-ho, that's okay. It is what it is. I'll show you what I got anyway. So this here, if I was to complete all of this, then that would be a page finish. Um, I'm not going to get that done, obviously. Uh, but I'm working on it a little bit. Um, and so that is that. So I'll just give you a broader picture. I'll just turn this light off so it's not so... There we go. So that's, that's what it is so far. That's what I've gotten done. Um, I'm enjoying it. I just, I'm just not having the time for it. I'm not having the time for really anything. Um, uh, but it is what it is and I'm enjoying it when I am doing it. And that's all that really matters, right? As for my dragonfly, that's what it's supposed to look like in the end. And this is what I've gotten done so far. So this, pin, okay, sorry about that. Those of you who have kids understand they fight. So this is the page top of where I'm working. And then this here is the page bottom. And according to here, so where are we? So I've done this here, and now I'm just doing this and going to do this leaf here. Um, and then about here. So about here is where, about here is where the page would end. Um, what is the date? Let's see. March. Hello, March. Where are you? Oh, okay. Yeah, so today's the last day, so that, that's, that's about where I'm going to get to it this month. I'm not going to be stitching on this um, till the end of, I don't know. I'll be stitching on it next month sometime. I don't, I can't tell you when. But that's what I got done this month, just just this much. So that's it. I thought I would give you a uh, a good backdrop of my bell once again. She's just here displayed for us to look at. Um, I'm going to say goodbye to you guys for this uh, video. Thank you guys so much for watching.
and um, stay tuned for next month where I will have um, the same old same old <laughs> I'm an exciting stitcher aren't I I am going to be pulling out my Tuscany piece um, for the anniversary of my trip to Italy so that will be a new addition for April so take care everybody and I hope you're having a wonderful Easter um, and I hope you're enjoying your time with your family and having a great awesome spring break so I will see you guys in two weeks perhaps for my uh, mid-month vlog update thanks for watching mm -hmm. see you again bye bye the Easter Bunny is gonna come Okay, we're in bed now, and I just got my Zoe bear lying right next to me. Here's me. Here's my bear. And she's, well, she's almost as long as I am. She's in for a little nap before she goes out again to do her night patrol. A uh, teddy bear ring pop? <sighs> Wait, where did my face go? I'm playing a green little pop. Happy Easter.